What is up guys, it's Awana Turtle and today we're doing a Yu-Gi-Oh opening. We are opening up some more of these Flame Destruction Special Edition boxes. This time we're going for three of them, so we have nine packs total plus some promo cards. Uh, and uh, let's get right into it. Okay, all the boxes are open. Let's take a look at our promos. And I do want to make sure we get at least uh, one of the, I think it's the Avram. So for the first one, we got World Legacy Memory. And then Grand Soul the Elemental Lord. Very cool card. Universal Adapter. And then, um, I can't read that first part. Uh, the Elemental, no, 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 Elemental Lord. Then another World Legacy. Another Grand Soil. So I didn't. I do think at this point we do have all of them <clears throat> and let's get into nine packs of flames of destruction definitely hunting for that infinite permanence and as well as there's a lot of actually a lot of good cards in this set which is why i opted to get these boxes uh and also i just love the archetypes i feel like there's a lot of cool like mech dragons that i'm really into all right so let's see first pack we got a red haired beastie horse watch cat name maki defrag dragon looks pretty cool and then wind up zen maintenance uh then we have fa dawn dragster crystal master followed by transfamiliar and goki bear hug hoping for at least one secret rare out of the nine packs definitely all the the biggest hits are all in the secret rare slot which isn't great uh however i'm confident we can get at least one we got a mech knight avram shadal construct Restoration of the Monarchs. And then a Nightmare Cerberus. Pretty cool card. And then a Trickstar Defendium. Trickstar Mandrake. Battery Solar. And then Vendred Daybreak. Followed by Crystal Master. Alright, so, so far two packs. Nothing too great. We only got two supers. However, reminder that every pack does come with a super. And a rare. So let's see, we got a Goku... Goki's Octo Stretch. I think that card's actually really good. Uh, Gurgon's End, Space Insulator, World Legacy Corruption, and then our super rare is the Phos <laughs> Phosphorage, the Elemental Lord. So they definitely they have like I think they have Elemental Lord for every uh, type or every um, element. Uh, Cyrus Cyclone, another Master, and then Waking of the Dragon. Oh, and I am hoping to use these sleeves, so we finally did get some sleeves that are the right size for Yu-Gi-Oh! Instead of uh, using the one that's more for Magic the Gathering or Pokemon. Just because these cards are significantly smaller. Alright, let's see. We got a Mamen Maki. Another Defrag Dragon. like that art. Gurgong's End. And then Called by the Grave. Very, actually a very solid common. Rainbow Refraction for the Super. And then a Revendred Executor. Cyrusal Cyclone, Crystal Master, and then another Waking of the Dragon. Alright, so we got five packs left, just about halfway through. So far, nothing too crazy in the in the um, secret slash super rare slot. So we got Elemental Saber Malo. Restoration of the Monarchs again. Another Octo Stretch. Gurgong's End, and then a Trickstar Rodode. Hmm. Really struggling to get that secret rare, guys. Background Dragon, Crystal Conclave, Crystal Master. Four packs left. Even or, or maybe just an ultra rare. There's like, I think there's only one that World Legacy Succession that's really great. Monster Reborn Reborn. Another Defrag. And then, oof, man. Getting some dupes at this point. Fire, Fire Fighting Daruma Doll. What is going on here? Starling, starring, staring contest, Altergeist Pixiel, and then Elemental Saber Aina. Trickstar Bloom. Come on, guys, let's get at least one secret. I feel like we're been on a bit of a dry spell in the Yu Gi Oh openings. Space Insulator, World Legacy Corruption, 
right in. This guy looks like he's uh, like a kendo. Looks like he's, I don't know, it's like a lightsaber, but not a lightsaber. And then Palace R. So here's our Ultra Palace of the Elemental Lords. Not the one we're looking for, but Ultra nonetheless. Backup Operator. And then Trans Familiar, Goku Bear Hug, Altergeist Miletov, and World Legacy Nightmare. I guess we'll use this as an excuse to get into our sleeves that are the correct size for this game. So I was hoping to use it on a little bit of a bigger hit. Ooh, very nice. Alright, so we do have one Ultra. Come on, let's get a secret. To be honest, I'm not sure what the, uh, the ratio is, especially out of these boxes. However, we just assume the ratio from uh, booster boxes is probably about 1 every 12. So, Restoration of the Monarchs. Goki Octo Stretch. Gurgong's End. Ooh, yes, Vampire Sucker. Here we go. We do have a secret rare in the Vampire Sucker. Uh, maybe we'll read this through um, after the fact. Uh, it is definitely one of the bigger hits, though, so really happy about that. World Legacy Awakens. Cyclone Background Dragon, Conclave, and then Crystal Master. Alright, so we did get one of the secrets. Very nice pull right there. Tricks. Vampire Sucker. And into our last pack. Don't need to worry about... We don't need to rely on any clutch last pack magic. Because of that Vampire Sucker. But we'll see if we can't really, really knock this one out of the park. For the last pack, we got a Kaiden Kendo Spirit, F.A. Dead Heat, uh, Tra Tra Tin Dangle Trinity, Tridal Construct, and then a Nightmare Cerberus. So that's our second one of these. I do like that card. World Legacy Struggle. And then, ooh, I haven't seen this one. Flower, Cardian, Moon, Flower Viewing. <laughs> There's a lot a lot to consume there. Altergeist, Gledef, and then Trickstar Mandrake. So, um... Better than our first opening of this set, we got an ultra rare in the Palace of Elemental Lords, which is just okay. But then I'm very happy with the Vampire Sucker Pull. Um, so, yeah, three boxes, uh, pretty good results. Um, and uh, yeah, let me know what you think in the comments. Maybe there's a card that I'm not familiar with that is actually a bigger hit than, I, than I'm privy to at the moment. So definitely let me know in the comments below. If you did enjoy this video, please hit that like button down below. It does help the channel grow. And uh, definitely subscribe if you're new to the channel. Uh, just so you do see uh, notifications for future comments, guys. On that, guys, I'm Awana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.